our fans, as we know, and then there are super fans who cannot hide their Phillies pride. That's right. I'm just news reporter Ryan Hughes is live outside of Citizens Bank Park after meeting a couple who took him inside their shrine to the Phillies. Tell us more, Ryan. Yeah, guys, we have spotted a number of fans, one after the other, coming to the Steam store here at the bank. They're, of course, buying T-shirts, hats, and jerseys. And over the past couple of days, we have spoken to a number of passionate fans. But today, we think we possibly found two of the biggest fans in our area. Take a look. This time of year, many homes are decorated for Halloween. But with the red hot Phillies making it back to the NLCS, Phil signs are popping up in people's yards. We were doing mums and pumpkins, and then all of a sudden, when all this happened, I said to him, Yeah, we need to represent. We yeah. stopped by Sally and Basil D'Antonio's yeah. home in Nickelton, Gloucester County. They bought these signs in 2008 when the Phil's won the World Series, and now they're back in the front lawn. It's something that we need at this time. Right? Sally and Basil are die hard Phil's fans. They invited us inside their home, down into the basement, decked out in Philly's memorabilia, but it's not called the man cave. Sally refers to it as the woe man's cave because her passion for the Phils may be stronger than her husband's. This is my little collection. I'm a huge, huge Darren Dalton fan, of course. Sally has collected trinkets over the years. And of course my ring. Beautiful, right? And the basement beams with the pride of the Phillies. Autographed photos and baseballs are displayed on the walls. There's a life size cutout of Darren Dalton, and even the couch is red. This is from the 2008 game, the two part game. The South Jersey couple has photos from the World Series in 08, and now they're already making predictions as the Phillies take on the Padres in the NLCS. Phillies in five? Yeah, I'm saying four. Phillies in four. Yeah. You think it's going to be a sweep? Yeah. I like that. I agree with Sally. Wouldn't that be wonderful if the Phillies took it in four? Well, another thing that Sally said this afternoon that really resonated with me, she said in life there is hope and in baseball there is hope. Well, this is a city desperately hoping for another trip to the World Series. And coming up at 6 o'clock, we will hear from a number of other fans talking about how the Phillies have really united this city, all sharing now a similar passion. We'll talk more about that at 6 o'clock. But for now, we we are live in South Philadelphia. Ryan Hughes, CBS3 Eyewitness News. And we hope they are just getting started. Thank you so much, Ryan.